the list goes on and on in terms of this technology and how it might start to displace the way humans are doing things. My name is Dr. Katie Selegi, and I am an assistant professor here at the Faculty of Law at the University of Manitoba. Artificial intelligence, or AI, and the law are two issues that have become really enmeshed in the last little while. And with the growth of AI industries, it's something we can expect to see more of in the coming years. One of the ways that we see artificial intelligence coming into the judicial system is through automated decision makers, or ADMs. Uh, an example of this is sentencing software. Sentencing software is a tool that's already being used by judges based on artificial intelligence, actuarial markers, and different kinds of statistical methods to assess how long a prisoner's sentence should be. We already know that sentencing software has a lot of problems in terms of implicit bias and perpetuating racist stereotypes within the judicial system. One of the many things I'm concerned about is that if we don't correct these types of biases, uh, as increased work is delegated to machines, we're going to see an amplification of the types of discriminatory things that we otherwise might have moved away from in broader society. What my work looks at is the storytelling aspect of law and understanding how we think through law as narratives. So how do we better understand the lived experiences of people at the margins of society if we delegate this type of decision making entirely to machines? Law traditionally has been an exercise in collective storytelling and in defining fictions that knit our society together in different ways. That has had some problems in the past, to be sure, but if we allow AI to take it over, we might see the amplification of biases or other things that we just don't want in a future that we're collectively building together. You know, I think that today's students are coming to school at an interesting time where technology is starting to bleed into the legal profession and displace some of the traditional roles. And so students were going to have to turn their minds to what that looks like in their legal careers and become really engaged in what are the important roles for lawyers in thinking through the solutions to these problems.